Hello everybody, welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Super Mario Odyssey. In the last episode we finished up, we are, we almost finished up the um, Sand Kingdom. But there are just a few more moons that we can get. And we're going to go ahead and get uh, uh, the last few right now. So, one is right here. Here we got a nice collection of moons. We're going to add almost 50, well, more than 50 to our collection, to our overall count. This is really cool. We can go ahead and take a shortcut here, get back to the top of the ruins. Now, if you listen real closely, you can tell that um, the pitch of the mu music changes often because of the uh, of the um, um, what's it called? The spike thing, the electricity thing, changes pitches um, as you go throughout the level. Oh. There's one more moon than I thought there'd be. Ow. Use Cappy to hit it. This is the first instance of these ground pound needing moves. Uh, moons. It can be a little hard to get, but I don't know how a moon moves around. It's weird. Um, but also, if you notice, the Sphinx says something about it. Uh, in the last episode of the episode before, I don't remember, um, that there were six up here, and we just saw that. And luckily, there's also a Jaxi, um, a Jaxi, uh, thing here. <coughs> so if we go up here, carefully, hold the brake, yeah. You just need to get them in the general vicinity. I know this is but my days of standing around are done. So yeah, welcome back, Jaxie. See so you can get him. And I guess we're gonna leave this area with 54 moons. I'm tempted, guys. I'm tempted. I'm gonna go for it. Yolo! Oh, we're not gonna make it. Yeah, we're not gonna make it. No. Yeah. No fall damage, but when you do fall uh, a long distance, then Mario um, gets a little cartoony shaking up. Wait. I think there's one more moon we can get. One last one. Can we? Is this one? I'm bad. Yeah, there's at least two. I don't know if this is the same eagle. No, it's a different eagle. Neat. There we go. Actually, there's one more moon. I'm gonna be leaving with um, 56. Now this is kind of a hard moon to get. So if you're not overly ah good with your things, so basically what you want to do is you want to keep going. Um, you just keep rolling. Oh crap! Oh well, we can uh, we can get the uh, checkpoint up here. And this should be the uh, next last thing we do here. We're of course going to get the model that we didn't get in the last episode. So basically you want to just hold down the button and keep lawn jumping. Don't try to roll, don't try to just roll off the, the side, it doesn't work. As you can see clearly there. A Jaxi will almost always spawn there and get half our coins back. 
A thing to note about Cappy is you can throw him. Like, if you do that, you can throw him again, but you can't bounce on him twice in one, um, one thing. Jump. Oh, come on. You just... Basically, you just want to hold down crouch. That's all you need to do, and then jump and uh, jump at the right times. And you should be able to make it, because you'll keep up your momentum. You can also hold down crouch and uh, hold forward while you're um, falling to actually just straight up roll into it instead of um, instead of uh, uh, having to like um, like uh, get stunned and stuff. You can also, um, you can also throw Cappy, like, at the last second to prevent yourself from getting stunned when you fall. It's just, it's just a brief moment where, um, the threshold is to not get, um, stunned when you fall. We're going to collect these again. Who's going to say no to free coins? <coughs> And we'll get the last of the stuff we can get here, which is the model. Now one thing I wish they added to this game, which you, we will see here in like a second, is I wish they added, um, see how the sticker's already on there? I wish you could customize the sticker that you put, that you could put on. So here, here we got our first instance of, um, new thing, uh, like our little, uh, statues we can have in. And by the end of the game, we're going to have a ton of stuff to have that's going to be all over this place. And it'll be great. It'll be awesome. You can also see the little pattern of the world on the bottom. You can also change your clothes, look in the mirror, all that good stuff. But we are going to go ahead and head off to the next kingdom. Now we could go ahead and go off to, uh, go back to the Cap Kingdom or the Cascade Kingdom and, um, get a moon or two. Well, you get, you could get more moons in the Cascade, uh, Cap Kingdom or we could go to the, um, you get moons and, uh, the regional coins in the Cascade Cape Kingdom and spend co coins in the, uh, Cascade Kingdom. We're gonna go ahead and go to the Woody Kingdom first, over the Lake Kingdom, because we're gonna go to all the kingdoms anyway. And the Woody Kingdom is a larger one. Actually, I'm gonna save the Woody Kingdom for the next episode. So, this episode we're gonna go back to um, first and foremost the uh, Cascade Kingdom, get the rest of the stuff, uh, the stuff we can get there. And then we're gonna go to the um, um, Cape King, Cap Kingdom, <coughs> and get hopefully all the stuff we can can get there. If not, then oh well, we'll do it in the next episode. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Cappy. Yeah, just go and skip it. I should have skipped it before. Yeah, all we need to do is just buy the moon from the store and then buy the outfit. And we can go ahead and wear it for a little bit. Not re I'm not a real big fan of the outfit here. I'm gonna get some free coins. <coughs> and as you can see, the train chomp's gone. So actually, the uh, caps from Bonneton are here. So we're gonna go ahead and get the moon power moon then we can go ahead and get the uh, all the souvenirs from here 
so we can get the caveman outfit and the caveman cap, which is just a dry bones. You can get the sticker of Fossil Falls. You can get the T-Rex statue. And we can get the Triceratops trophy. That's it. Okay. I'm considering the, um... <coughs> you also hit the radio. You get a different song. Or a different little sound effect. Um, yeah, that's all we can do right now in the um, Cascade Kingdom for now. So, I guess we're going to go ahead and head back to the Cap Kingdom and finish up there. 76. Oh boy, one. Go ahead and move on to the next. Come back to the Cap Kingdom. Skip it. Bother with it. Skip. Skip. Skip it all. We don't need it. How oh, we can go and watch this. We are severely underdressed. Um, right off the bat, if we go over here, we can get some more, um, uh, regional coins. Our first three. I don't know, something about this place. This is a, this is like a really, this is actually a kind of a Halloween-y place with the music. I know, but this is kind of like a dreary, dark, like, nah, nah, kind of, a uh, kind of, a uh, level. I don't know. Last time I, I played this, um, I actually got this far in my um, previous Let's Play. But um, last time I played this, I really had nothing to talk about. I still don't really have much to talk about. But I, f I feel I've gotten slightly better since then. And the whole six people that watch my uh, are, as of this time, are subscribed to me, can probably. Uh, know that. Come on. Come on. Ah. It's a little bit. There we go. The worst part is we have to do it again. Come on. I hate the frogs. The frogs are the worst part of this game. There. Oh, come on. Now, these moons are more, like, moon-colored. Like, just a normal, like... A normal... Um... Like, nice yellow color. There we go. It's kind of worried that I wouldn't be able to get up there. Um, we're gonna need another frog. Crap. See that moon high in the air? It was actually a glitch with Takatu that you could, um, later on there's a moon you have to get that you could use, um, it was a glitch to get the, um, to get the high score on the thing. A lot of people abused it. I, myself, was one. Because it's, it's kind of a tedious game, minigame, and we'll, we'll get to it later on. But overall, it's, it's just like, eh, eh, I'm really bad at it. And I'll mention it again. Anyway, if we talk to this, um, cap lad, I guess. Look at no button tongue. Uh, I know already. Oh, I thought he had a moon. Oh, well. This platform wasn't here before, which I didn't show because I didn't fancy dying. But that platform wasn't there before, or in our first visit. So it's kind of strange. Oh, this area. This area is a little, um... 
I don't know. This, this area is kind of... It's kind of... It's really annoying because of the frog physics, as it were. <coughs> but other than that, it's, uh, it's an alright area. If you look carefully over here, you can see that there's a nice little area with coins in. Now this is this isn't the only secret to be had in this level here. There's also a moon. Well. You can't really look up there, but high atop the crystal tower, there's a moon we can get to. I'm gonna do a couple of spin jumps. Not really spin jumps, but you know what I mean. Flips. And here's our four coins of this area. Now you can tell what, uh, what levels are smaller worlds and what levels are larger worlds. By the amount of coins you have, you can uh, obtain in them. So in this one, we can only obtain 50 coins. So this is one of the smaller levels. Flip there. Go and get up. Um, where are we? See, if you look up there, there's the bonus moon. Let's try to get it. Ah, oh, so close. You're so close to getting up there. Actually, I think we can get good enough yeah we can get up here get up here get up here no okay good I'm glad that platform was there come on I don't want to just do normal jump there secrets of the frog pond oh, I hate this I hate this place I'm glad it's over I'm glad we're done. Yeah, Lee. This is by far one of the worst places in the game. Just based on my opinion. Well, I really, I really dislike the frog. Also, some coins there, and we can also get our. Uh, Second and final Goomba catch, which is the gonna be the um. Oh, we need a few more coins. Ah, I know where some are. Some back here. There we go. Now we can get the outfit here. We can get that. Get out of this caveman outfit. We can also get a pair of Goomba. That's what I was saying. This is, one, this is also one of the only cap stores in the game, uh, crazy cap stores rather, that um, doesn't have like a wardrobe thing that you can change in. Now we're properly attired for this occasion. Up here, this, if we hit this, oh no that's not until later, there's a moon there later that you can hit and then you can get um, uh, you can get uh, a moon there. These they usually give you coins. Oh, Cap Mario. I don't know. I don't know how to get that one. That, that it puzzles me. It perplexes me. They are often the distance. I th oh, that's actually Cat the Cascade Kingdom. Interesting. I thought that was another, um, that was another, um, thing, but I, I suppose it would make the most sense to be the Cascade Kingdom. I thought that was another one of the kingdoms. And get these coins down here. And when we get these coins over here, we're gonna go and end off the episode. Go ahead and commit murder with one of its own kind. So, with that, in the next episode, we will get those coins over there and hopefully finish off the Cap Kingdom. So, I'll see you guys then.